Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents with a prophetic word. For somebody out there, one of you has a word from God, and this is what I got in my spirit just now. You have not been forgotten of me. Hmm. So God is telling somebody out there, I haven't forgotten about you. You know, Jesus said in the Bible, I will never leave thee nor forsake thee. And forsake means forget. You know, how some people say out of mind, uh, you know, out of sight, out of mind. That's not God. We're never out of his sight. And we're never out of his mind. So don't you think you're you're fumbling through this thing by yourself because you're not. You've got reinforcements you don't even know about. He says angels round about us. And we don't even know what's going on. And they're working on our behalf. So don't lose your faith while things are looking cloudy. Just because you can't see the car in front of you in a fog does not mean the car is not there. All right. Now, this is the scripture the Lord gave me to give you. This is Psalms chapter 113, two verses, seven and eight. He raises up the poor out of the dust and lifteth the needy out of the dunghill that he may set him with princes, even with the princes of his people. You know, you may think that, that nobody even thinks about you because you don't count for anything or you don't count for much. But that's not the way God thinks of you. When he's looking at your heart, he sees a jewel, a precious. Oh, he sees... He looks at you as being precious in his sight. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. Listen, okay, um, the other scripture that came to my mind to read to you is... This is Isaiah chapter 55, verse 9. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways the higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. Pat's two cents. So if you don't quite get what God's doing, if you're getting frustrated at him, and it just seems like life is picking at you right in through here. Whatever is going on, God is still the one in the driver's seat. He's still the one calling the shots. And if he allows some things, do you know the a storm may be brewing in your life? And you may wonder, what the heck is all this about? What did I do wrong? But do you know there are some seeds that need to be planted? Some germinating that needs to take place in order to bear more fruit? And some seeds travel by wind. Some seeds travel by rain. Whatever's going on in your storm, God is accomplishing something for you with you in mind. Do not doubt now. Now's not the time to doubt. Do everything you can to solidify your faith. Trust God when you don't know what the heck he's doing. There's a song that says when you can't trace his hand, trust his heart. He alone is faithful and true. He alone knows what is best for you. 
trust his heart. Lean not to your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him. Don't leap. Don't be so quick to act. You know the old adage, that this is not scripture, but you know the old adage? Fools rush in where angels fear to tread. Don't be in a rush. Don't be in a hurry. God's timing is always the best. Yeah. I'm trying to see if God wants to say anything else before I click off. Okay. Psalms 3. I'm going to look that up real quick. So you guys be patient with me. Because I'm trying to be led by the Lord. Sometimes, you know, we're ready to rush off and be done with something. And God might be saying, where are you going? I'm not finished. I'm still talking here. So let's see what God has to say here. I have no idea what this is saying. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Uh, this is uh, Psalms chapter 3. I'm just going to start reading. Lord, this is David uh, as he fled from his son Absalom. Lord, how are they increased that trouble me? Many are they that rise up against me. Many there be which say of my soul, there is no hope, there is no help for him in God. But thou, O Lord, art a shield for me, my glory and the lifter up of mine head. I cried unto the Lord with my voice, and he heard me out of his holy hill. I laid me down and slept. I awaked, for the Lord sustained me. Let me stop here. Pat Love and her two cents. God will sustain you. He will sustain you. Mm. I will not be afraid of 10,000 people that have set themselves against, round, against me round about. Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten all mine enemies upon the cheekbone. Thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Salvation belongeth unto the Lord. Thy blessing is upon thy people. Take that to the bank. All right? Yeah, when your knees get to shaking and your teeth get to rattling, and your nerves get frayed. And your hair stands up on end for fear. You take that to the bank. God is telling you. He's got you covered, baby. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You sit and watch. Sit. Don't panic. Sit. Shut your mouth. Let him fight your battles. The battle is the Lord. 